5 o'clock in the morning, uh, Anzac Day. I'm just going to go for a quick run up the passage and uh, see what we can't pick up. Beautiful sunrise to start Anzac Day off. And here comes another plane. like a flathead. Got a few head knocks actually. Little flounder. That's a good sized flounder there. That's a winter whiting. That's a good size winter whiting. There's no size limit on them. A bag limit of 50, I think. You can tell they're winter whiting because of these black bars. They'll either have bars or little dots. Let's see what he measures up. 25. Don't want call them grinners. See all those teeth? Just put the hairline out, and before it even hit the ground, I was on on the flounder. That one's a leopard flounder. Good size too. Really good size.
straight over the top again. Just had a massive hit and he smoked me. Uh, might use that same piece actually. See if I can get one more out of that. Him. He's not as big. Oh, uh, actually, that's him. Just hope it's not a stingray. Please don't be a stingray or a shovel nose. Oh. Flatty! Beautiful flatty! No! No! Come back! Oh. Oh. Oh, get him! Got him! No, mate! Got him! Oh! I knew I could get him back again. He hit me once. He ran! Lost him! I thought I'd get him again. Look at that. He's fat too. Good sized dusky. That's excellent. Sorry about the camera angle. I'm in by myself here, so just under 50 there. Missed the hookup, sorry guys, but I got a little sand flathead, a bar tailed flathead that one is. A little bar tailed sand flathead. And I will release him. Here we go. It's a bit past 12 o'clock, right on lunchtime. I reckon we should cook these up. So I'm just going to fill it them on my esky here. So I've already, I've already slit the whiting's throat, and I just like to go from from the anal and sort of once you get it into his skull, you really push up into it. And just being careful. See that? You pull his head off with all four fins. 
perfectly. Look at that. We throw that, we don't need that. But if you haven't seen my warning video, my previous one, I'll show you exactly how to fill it and skin a whiting. You know, flathead come in behind the fins, straight down to the head, 45 degree angle. There you go, tilt your knife around. You'll just follow the body all the way down, just follow that spine. set up, little butane can, put that in there, it's locked in. So, and we're just going to get that in there, flare him up, and we're just going to chuck it in. It's got a nice coat on it. We're going to put some seasoning all over that. Can't forget the lemon. to try this, have a look. Alright, so we got our whiting on top here. That's flathead there. Oh, I don't know what to try, I'll go whiting. Try this little bit. Oh, that's beautiful. That's absolutely beautiful. So, that's a bit of flathead there. There's nothing better than catching your own fish, cooking it straight away, and oh, it's just beautiful. It's better than anything else you could ever, ever buy in the shop. Oh. And to sit out here and do it all. You guys have to try this. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, please be sure to like and subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, stay tuned because there's a lot more to come just like this.